NAD plus is one of the carriers of hydrogen protons. You can see it here, you can see it here, you can see it here. So NAD is one of the carriers of hydrogen protons. By the way, it's carrying these hydrogen protons where right now? This is the Krebs cycle. It's going to carry these off to where? The electron transport channel. Did you guys read the textbook? Read this part in the textbook? If you don't, it'll be bad because I've got a full lecture section. You need to be reading the textbook. What I did the other day was simplify the textbook for you. But from the way that you guys aren't answering my questions, I'm afraid that your exam's going to be really, really tough. So I'm adding to this. So NAD happens to be the carriers of these um, hydrogen protons. And by the way, let's take a look at what carries yep. FADH2. You can see right here, these are also carriers of hydrogen protons and hydrogen electrons. Okay. It doesn't make sense for me to have you memorize these. You would be memorizing stuff that you don't even know. Right? What I'm trying to teach you is why all of this happens. 